This is a report as well from Adam Schefter. Apparently, Adam Schefter, who is a uh, he breaks news in the NFL all the time. He was doing something. He works for ESPN. He was doing something called the Gritty out on Soldier Field in Chicago after the latest Monday Night Football game. And it appears that while doing the gritty, a dance. I figured. Do you know it, Biggie? I do. I've seen it enough, yeah. And I've seen this video of him doing it. He this did is it. A, I, this must be the move that I see a lot of players, mm-hmm. saw a lot of players doing over like mm-hmm. between Christmas and New Year's. The gritty, G-R-I-D-D-Y. And apparently he has torn his ACL doing the gritty. At least that's <laughs> the preliminary yeah. indication. They broke the news on ESPN. And our other breaking news of the day is that Adam Schefter is getting an MRI on his knee. He's already gotten, Had. waiting yeah. on the results, Adam, Correct. due to a strain that resulted via this gritty performance. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Uh, Adam. Well, Laura, Laura, we don't know that. I'm presuming because it was shortly after ahead. that my knee began bothering. So it can't be proven that it was from that. But... <laughs> It could have been on this particular twist right there. That, that there was some damage done to the right knee. We'll see. We're waiting the results of the MRI. When we have it, we will bring it to you as soon as we have it. I've injured myself dancing before. I used to do something called uh, the giant, or mm. as Chris Tim's mother called it, the Carolina hop. <laughs> <laughs> or twisted an ankle. Uh, I always like that. Broke a dance floor, too. Almost pulled yeah. down a tent at my wedding. Tent and parquet floor at the Diesel's S- wedding. Snapped a floor. Split in half. <laughs> I was heavier then. I was heavier. And my heels just couldn't take it in those dress shoes, you know, at a uh-huh. wedding. Yeah. I haven't done it in a while. I've retired the Carolina Did you just lose your balance or were you drunk a little too? I drunk a little. And, uh, well, when they play ABBA, I just go. Dancing you know. Queen just sets them off. Dancing Queen starts. I just do it. Do mm-hmm. you anticipate bringing that out of retirement at, say, a son's wedding or yeah. a daughter's yeah. wedding? Yeah, I would do that at their weddings. Uh, I'm sure they would stop me quickly, <laughs> but I will do that. Make that your first dance for mm-hmm. your <laughs> It's most a yeah. big jump while yeah, yeah, yeah. Quit, while uh, during the quit. chorus. Y- yes, exactly. Yeah, it, it's sort of like free interpretation during the verses. Correct. But the chorus is very specific. Yeah. Correct. And it was remember it was Christian's mother who named it the Carolina Hop, and the <laughs> the the dance floor had split long before that. Oh. People started, especially older people, would look at it like, "My God, yeah. what is he doing? Who, is he okay? Who is that?" Because I was usually all sweaty too, and my tie had yeah. come loose. Shirts and, plastered to you with sweat. Correct. That, speaking of this, I'm now, looking at the gritty. What, how do you? It's barely even moving. I, I don't know how You're just he, shuffling two feet. It is yeah, kind of a slow shuffle. Yeah, it was weird how, how he heard himself. I don't know how he heard himself. <laughs> well, and let me tell you, the best part is ESPN when he first did it before the injury was like, look at him, oh, <laughs> look at him being with it. <laughs> Oh, they they promoted the hell out of when it. You barely even move. No, he's hard. I know. I was surprised. And, and hardcore yeah. like NFL insiders say that this the field at Chicago State, uh, the Soldier, Soldier Field, is one of the worst. Is that right? It's one of the worst playing surfaces. So it's claimed another. Isn't that true? <laughs> Adam Schefter. Schefter. <laughs> no real it. grass there. It got it is real. Grass. It is real yeah. grass. Huh. But they say it's mostly. I, I saw Dirt. a kicker saying it's mostly sand. I bet they. That might be a stadium that changes to. That's the rumor. You know, in, buzzing around in the Midwest, like Pittsburgh, they have grass fields. They're talking about, They're talking about stay. Yeah. I'll bet you. And this is this is much to Dave's chagrin that eventually it's almost all that field turf that they play on. You know, well, it's, it was fifty fifty right now though in the NFL, isn't it? We went through them one day. That's right. Chris Tim said, "Don't ever do that again." <laughs> Remember that? You got hey, Seattle, Arizona, <laughs> field turf, San Francisco. <laughs> Natural grass. <laughs> LA. Guys. Oh, guys. See that? He, he wouldn't, LA. He wouldn't but the, do the that. rumor in Chicago is that the, the Bears are going to move from Soldier Field. Yeah, that's, they're further gonna, in. They're going to build a, and build a yeah. dome. I would hate to see that. Yeah. But Soldier Field's not even close to what it used to be. You know, it used to be that you could tell it had been around since the 30s or whenever it was. Mm-hmm. And then they built all they around it. had to modify it. It looks completely. It's from the 20s. It's from World yeah. War One. And then, But now you can't even see that kind of stuff. Now it's just like a no, big No, they stick. redid it, and it's just got that the column facade, mm-hmm. the facade. They, um... It seats the fewest people in the NFL, Soldier Field. Is that right? Yeah. And so they would move out to where more fans, Mm -hmm. it's easier for fans to get to and that kind of thing. Uh, The last piece of sports dirt is from Australia. Tune-ups for the Australian Open are going on. And something happened that I had never seen before, and neither had these announcers. One of the tennis players, his name is Riley Opelka. He was in the tune-up, and during it, a bird pooped on his hat. 4-4 in the first set. (laughs) <laughs> and this is the event, this is the incident when it took place. A bird relieved itself on the hat of uh, Riley Opelka. Mm. Did you hear him say, I just got crapped on? Yeah. Right. So there's an incident here now. 
there was a delay of what about are the protocols? five minutes. He goes over to the umpire and he changes his hat. But the new hat he put on had too large of a logo. And it was the only hat that he had <laughs> really out of the court. So the umpire said, you can't wear that. And this is the exchange they had now between the umpire and the player. Just, I just ask your, your coach to give you one. The one he has on, the, on his head. Mate, I got sh- Please. Just, just this one. I don't, mate. I'm not wearing another brand. Like, there's sh- on it, dude. <laughs> give it to me. Just give it to me. I really want to play with sh- on my head. <laughs> 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 Thank you. Thank you. Crowd got restless. He said, there's crap on my head. I don't want to play with S on my head. Not playing with crap on my head. And the umpire said, just have your coach give you one. At one point, the ball boy gave him his hat. But nope. it's too small for his head. So the guy, yeah. the guy said, I'm not playing with poop on my head. And it sounded like he said, I can't wear another brand. He said, I won't wear yeah. another brand. And, he said, and the umpire said, well, your logo's too big. So they didn't know what to do. The <laughs> logo's too big. Yeah, the logo... Apparently, there's rules that you can only have so large of a logo on your hat. And then one had three logos on it. He had three or four hats out there, but none of them would work. And one of them, now the poop was on the bill. I saw it. It was on the very edge okay. of the bill. And I felt like if it had been me, I would have just played on. They got a it. towel out there. Wipe it off. And Well, they said clean. The umpire said clean it. Now, yeah. if I'm not mistaken, mm-hmm. the match was at night. Correct. <laughs> That is right. Maybe go hatless for the rest of the set. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> the guy really made a big stink out of it when he could have just moved on. But but, but tennis players, you know, they, they wear hats regardless. Yeah, yeah if that's they, right. Indoors, that's day, right. night. And, that's just their thing. And maybe he is sponsored, so he needed that sponsor. You're right. I'm sure he is. All right. It was all resolved. Somebody ran to the locker room to get him another hat, and the announcers described it. Have you ever seen this before, Simon? Can't say that I have, Matt. Not this particular circumstance. A bird having a major impact. Hear the bird. On this ATP 250. Still there. So the lesson of the day is always have two caps sit in your kit bag just in case a bird <laughs> relieves itself. <laughs> Somebody from the coach's box is off to the races, out to get another hat. Thank and you. Even they see the lighter side of it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Do we know how long the delay was, Kelly? Six minutes. Wow. <laughs> I bet his opponent was pissed. That's an eternity. 